What's going on guys? So for today's video, we're going to be going over the 2021 Scorpion DC. I've used this a few times. I've had it for about a month and a half. Um, I haven't got like videos on it because I just started doing this whole YouTube thing. I figure, you know, I like going fishing and might as well just document me fishing, you know, the different things I buy, different reels, rods, lures, going over the design of things. It's just a hobby of mine, so why not just document it and share it with people and kind of keep it to my memories. So that's what I'm doing. Um, so yeah, anyways, for the Scorpion DC, this is my second my second DC rod or reel, um, my second DC reel, and I have the Shimano Karate DC. Everyone has that though, you know. It's tried and true. It's like you know, if you don't have a Shimano Karate, then you know what are you doing? But uh, yeah, I mean, this is easily came my favorite reel so far it's so smooth and uh, you know people say reels cast a mile but this truly can cast a bait a mile at least what I use it for I use it for uh, a little bit heavier crankbaits they're kind of that three-quarter ounce crankbaits um, I love to do Texas rigs too Whatever, really, spinner baits, it doesn't matter, but I've been mostly throwing crank baits on it. Um, it's been getting the job done. So I have, let's just show you a few pictures of different fish I caught over this last month. I just didn't get any footage, so I'll try to get some footage here. Now that I'm starting to film it, and you know, we can go over it. But this is what it looks like, it's, um, the thumb plate, it's, you know, it's doable. Yeah, it's gonna slip, it's not textured, you know, but it feels good. This is the 7.4. So it is the uh, micro module gear system in here. Um, it's a clean. That's what the knobs look like. The drag, just regular Shimano type of drag. <laughs> Nothing special there. It is kind of neat. I didn't know. This has a scorpion on the tension knob. It's kind of cool little design. It's red and black accents. It's a cool color. If you like cool flashy things, you know, this reel is pretty sweet. Looks pretty sweet. So yeah, on the side, it's got you know different brake settings. So that's the open. If you want to open up, you know, the spool, pop that open. And it has different settings as well in here for P, N, and F. So you got, you know, polymer, you got nylon, like, you know, braid, and F for fluorocarbon. So. I always keep it on the uh, fluorocarbon because that's what I'd be usually throwing on this reel. But yeah, it has an arrow there. You can see, sorry for the dirty hands. I work on the heavy equipment, so I've got dirty hands. But yeah, it's got an arrow, and it points to what it's on, which is kind of neat, kind of cool touch. So that's how you open it. It also has... A wind, if you can see that, a wind setting. So if you're casting into the wind, then four other settings. I usually keep it on two. Um, that's how I use that. And for the for the uh, you know the tension knob, I usually do it until I don't really have it moving on the spool like that. That's how Shimano recommends it. Other reels, I just let the bait fall and just 
kind of see how I would usually do it for that. This is kind of different. Um, of course, Shimano. But, uh, yeah, this is the new reel. It's a 150 HG right hand. It's absolutely, absolutely smooth. You can cast a mile. I will get more footage of it and show it in action. This is just unboxing to see what it actually looks like. But yeah, that's the uh, 2021 Shimano Scorpion. Here's the box. Nothing special. If you can read uh, Japanese, there you go. Um, you know, it comes with the same old stuff. It comes with the lube if you want to oil it up. Um, the same stuff any other uh, Scorpion or any uh, Shimano comes with it all so yeah I can't wait to keep on using it it's definitely rigged up on a get the new uh, G Loomis rod for it um, and I can't wait to use that with it I got the lose team black rod and it works well 7.3 medium heavy it's perfect got a little bit of soft tip for crank baits that's what I really like to use for, for heavier crankbaits at least. But yeah, that's what it looks like, guys. So, uh, yeah, you'll see us soon in the video. See me catching some fish with it. Um, so yeah, you'll see it soon. See me catch some fishes with it. You know, it's going to be a asset to fishing. <laughs> Just look at that. Look how it sparkles. It's a cool design. Definitely. 150 HG. Alright guys, if you like this video, find it useful, please like, you know, comment. Whatever you want to do. Um... Just try to make some cool videos and help people out at the same time with the product they're not too sure about or whatever. Alright guys, have a good one.